Hi, ghost. This is my ghosty. Okay, my voice is cracking. <coughs> anyway, um, so we have a bunch of new suits coming into Love Nikki, and I'm down to now 59% of my wardrobe again. I was literally like 62%, and I dropped like 3%. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, all my hard work has just been somewhere anyway um so we have a new event coming and obviously the devs haven't announced it yet but it's already been into the game um from according to one of the people in the group chat called you um said that the male suit that we'll show later on in this video comes up to 500 diamonds ooh ooh am i gonna get it definitely it's bagging so 500 diamonds, sign me up. Anyway, let's look at this. So I'm guessing it's going to be a tiered event because she is basic and then with the dude, it comes with numerous of ornaments, so... Anyway, so let's talk about the hair. It's nice, it reminds me of Misa, you know, from Death Note. But Misa does have, like, pigtails along with hair down and a full fringe. Even though we don't normally see the back of Nikki's hairline, so... We just, um, yeah, it's pretty nice. It's pretty cool. Uh, it doesn't explain why the tails at the very bottom look like they're resting on some surface, but I do like how this looks. We have the coat, which reminds me of like a rabbit in Alice Win in Winter Wonderland. Winter Wonderland? Alice? Alice in Wonderland. There we go. Um... Okay, I, uh, I don't know what to make of this, but I do like the shading work. I do like how the gold trimmings to it looks very metallic. Um, I do like how this looks, especially on her. So it could be very usable with those bunnies we have in the... Uh, what was it called? Spirit of Sheen, I think it was. You know, those bunnies, you know, from, um, what's her face? The character I never care about, uh, da, 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 da. Yvette, there we go. Then we have the top, which is super cute. Uh, it's not really, like, much, you know, wow to it, but I do find it's very decent. I could use it on average-looking things, like creations. Off the bat, ugly. <laughs> That's all I have to say. Just one item, and furthermore, it's not really like, uh, I don't know, it doesn't look okay, but it looks fine with just the full suit of this, but on its own, no, <laughs> definitely not. I don't like the top part of these. Like, if they just kept it like, um, stockings, without that stupid thing on top of them, it would be fine. Uh, it's just, I don't, I don't like the top of that. I don't like how the tip of the toes look like it's curving. It looks very ridiculous. But overall, without the curving toe part, I think it, these shoes look adorable. But it has that curving part and I don't like it. This is pretty cute. I like that. I don't know what hat this is, but I've never seen this sort of style of a hat before, unless I'm missing a whole life of living. Gloves. Again, I don't like the top part. I do find these adorable in some way, but the top part actually puts me off a bit. Although I do like the red, and this is my favorite part of the suit. The winder, so I do. I, I absolutely love this, and I can use it for like a doll, like Marinette Grice's body, create something very gothic, creepy, doll wise. This would be very suitable for that. Okay, now here we go with the male. I don't know if it's gonna be a transgender because it does have boobs, but it looks like a boy to me. But let's just look at the items. We can't talk about gender because everybody finds it offensive. Ooh, whoop de doo <laughs> Okay, uh, hair. I love it. I love it a lot. I love the hair. It, it's like that sort of hair that could be very suitable with the, um... I've got an eyeball itch. 
um, top hats and so on and so forth. So this hair can be gender fluid, either female or male, so you know what I mean. I don't like the colour though, I mean it's very smooth, it's very soft, but I would like to have it in white or black, either the one. So I do like this brown, but I, w I wish to dye it black, because gothic vibes, yo. Then we have the coat. I wasn't I wasn't um expecting it to be greenish and I thought thinking like on the brownish side. But overall I don't literally hate it. I mean one of my friend well not friends, but you showed that white actually looks good with this green. So I'm gonna try and work with this coat with white items. Ooh. It's not really my taste though, isn't it? Then we have the brown coat while well, waistcoat and some like creamy top with it um see look you can see boobs i'm like okay i'm a bit confused are you a guy or a girl hmm i'm not too sure but do i care no um as long as the suit looks good i'm fine i'm classy it's just all it matters the look on the suit um i do like the bottom details of the waistcoat um where you see like little clock details to it so that's pretty cool i like the vintage touch to this so it's like really really nice and i like the fact this it comes with like a strap on the arm as well the leather strap on the arm that's pretty nice i like that <clears throat> These are my type. I don't know why I like shorts like this, but it gives me the Mei Misaki like vibes because Mei Misaki dresses dresses up in some typical. I'm not so so sure what she dresses up like, but these shorts remind me of that character. She's from another. Um, she's one of the main female characters, so you can't really miss her. Um, anyway, I do like these shorts. I could literally again, you can use these items for either female, male, either one. And these shorts reminds me of like those girls that loves their books and would dress it to match the cover of it. Uh, socks. These are my absolute favorite. I love the straps. I love the straps with socks. And the fact, again, it still reminds me of Mei Misaki from another because she does wear something similar to these socks. And I tried to make my Nikki look like her at some point, but we need a white bandage to look like her. And also black short hair that has bangs in the middle of it. Anyway, I love these, these socks. I think they're very adorable. I'm such a bias to these socks. <laughs> um, no matter if they're brown because we do have a lot of brown items in this game so far. Shoesies. I do like the little patterns on top and I like the buckles. Also the metallic um, sole to the shoe as well. Um, it ge again, it gives me the vintage vibes of a steampunk dude. It could be called, I wish it can be called steampunk because of course they name it um, after another suit but with different flipping last name. So like let's look at mechanical heart and then we have mechanical romance. I'm like just call it steampunk and then call this dude steam dude. <laughs> I'm not too sure. But anyway... Just clever clogs because he looks like a clever guy and he's covered in clogs. Anyway, uh, well, not not really. He's covered in gears. Oh, I don't care. Anyway, I do like these shoes. I do like this whole outfit altogether. Then we have the uh, great originality. Okay, that doesn't say much, doesn't it? Um, it looks like a magnifying glass, but in like a futuristic vintage type stuff. Um. I like it. It reminds me of that, some sort of like game, you know, where the characters look cartoony as hell, but it's 3D. Um, and then we come across with someone that looks steampunk as hell, that's into his mechanics. I'm not too sure what that game is, but it's very, very, very old. Then we have the Golden Wrench. Nice. And it's actually called Golden Wrench. Okay. Um... I do like how this looks as well. I mean, I like every single item this dude has besides the um, color of the hair. Anyway, I wish he came with the makeup. Like, seriously, come with the makeup. Um, I do like this. It gives, it's like a whole aesthetic to this dude. He's got everything. Oh my God, this bag. <gasps> my heart is melting over this bag. I don't like the fact it says Nikki on it, but I do understand it's their game and they could put her name on anything. But overall, the vintage touch to this. 
The shade work, the highlighting is beautifully done. I love this bag so bloody much. If I get mechanical romance done and involved, I could possibly try to use her hair on these items because she does have cherry red hair, which I die for. Oh my god. Um, but I do like this bag a lot. I mean, ever since I saw it, I'm like, I want you and I will get you. And look at me, I will get you. <laughs> Glovies, again, steampunk vibes, it reminds me of like a pilot gloves, you know, when they cut off the tips of the fingers on two fingers, which is kind of weird to me. Which of the whole thumb is covered? Actually, to cut the tips on all four fingers and left the thumbs to the whole thing. That's very cool. I, I haven't seen that style before anyway. We have the clock ground, which I do need a ground item at some point in my life, so please, 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 please come into my wardrobe because you're welcome Sam Sam Sada pointer I don't know what that means but okay cool nice bell tower phantom Ooh. but it doesn't explain what gender this dude is I'm, I'm saying guy because again it looks like a guy but it does have some feminine um items but I'm again I'm calling him and he okay 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 I do hope this clock comes without this um, gears so that we could just use the gears because you know you could separate the um, tree from you know the white feather suit I'm not too sure what she was called the first association war suit and you could actually get two items in one and yet and then you can have an option where if you uh, in your dress up and you could cut the tree off with from the stairs so that you could use the stairs or you could just use the tree and you can use a bump them both together the soon you know that sort of thing and I hope it's this theater with these two because I really want to use the gears without the clock so I'm hoping to separate them two in a starry corridor. So 500 diamonds, and I don't know what this red shadow of bell tower means. I think it's a background, I'm not too sure. I haven't checked the backgrounds, and I will not check as well. Um, I will review on my laptop, so you have to deal with my bad audio with the, fa with the pavilion suits. So, I, again, I'm sorry about the bad quality of audio, but again, I have nothing else to do. I tried to use it with my mic, but my mic doesn't even bloody work, so... Yeah, um, one issue after another, right? I don't like this one as much as this one, so I'm guessing it's gonna, again, be a tiered suit. Because we have to go through her first to get him, I'm guessing. <clears throat> I don't know what sort of event this is, but... I'm looking forward to it because just 500 diamonds, sign me up, have a nice life.